Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Lock security feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP Lock for Factory Reset Protection. Now, here with us today, we have a Samsung Galaxy S10e, and this is a device that does indeed have the Google Account Lock enabled. So as we can see here, the device as we're going through the setup steps to get to the screen that tells us that it was factory reset. And to continue, we have to either verify the previous security screen pin lock that was used, or if we tap on use my Google account instead, it'll pull up the secondary option that says that we can also sign in with a Google account that was previously on the device. So we've been contacted by tons of customers over the years asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific model. So we're now making a video to show any interested customers that we do offer a service to be able to get the lock removed from this model without having to have the previous user's login info. It's something that we do directly to the device while it's plugged into a computer. And the great thing about this is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You would just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection and we can remotely connect right to your computer through the internet to perform the exact same procedure that we did here with this one. So actually before starting the work, we had already done 99% of the steps in order to be able to keep the video as short as possible. The last step was just to restart the device. So as you guys could see very clearly, the device was on the Google lock screen. And then my, pro my computer program here just restarted it as the very last step. Now that that's done, you'll interestingly enough, be able to see that the device sends us directly to the lock screen where all the messages and notifications normally show up. And then if we go ahead and swipe that away, we'll see that we have direct access to the home screen with all of the apps and settings and features available to us. We've skipped through the initial setup steps completely and along with it, the Google account lock. And so it's just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. While we're here, I'm going to pop into the settings just to show you exactly what we are working with. So when we go down under About Phone, we can indeed see that we have a Galaxy S10e. And then since this is actually the Canadian version of the S10e, the model number of this one is SMG970W. So if you have one of these Canadian S10Es that has the Google Lock enabled and need help getting it removed, we would love to assist you with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description. And we'll also put a slide at the end of the video that has all of our info there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have on our channel because we offer a lot of different services for thousands of different models of devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. And while you're there, if you hit the subscribe button, that will make sure that you get notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like we're doing here with this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes también nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks so much, everyone, for watching, and have a great rest of your day.